I believe, yes, I was near death. I was not breathing. They checked for a pulse, I didn't have one. And fortunately, two of the guys were trained in CPR, so they began performing CPR on me. Todd had a ruptured brain aneurysm. At Cleveland Medical Center, we get about uh, 150 of those a year. Uh, and when they, when they come in um, as critically ill patients as Todd was, we immediately try to assess where the bleeding came from, what the aneurysm looks like, and assess the treatment options for that particular patient. Contrast that with a patient in whom we identify an unruptured aneurysm, we can plan their treatment, not do it as an emergency. If we do that with stents or coils, often the stay is just a day. Aneurysms fall under the portfolio of managing stroke. At UH, Cleveland Medical Center is a comprehensive stroke center. Uh, so we have the highest level of expertise in managing patients with uh, blockages in the brain and blood vessels and bleeding in the brain, which, of which brain aneurysms form a part of that. Uh, we have a comprehensive team of neurologists, neurosurgeons, neurointensivists who all work together to take care of these patients. We have a very high volume of patients that come here, which you need in order to provide the best level of care. Uh, from a procedural standpoint, our cerebrovascular neurosurgeons are trained both in open surgery as well as endovascular surgery, minimally invasive techniques uh, where you have the latest technologic advances available to patients, which is, I think, critically important to offer all the options in a comprehensive way. Uh, and so you need a lot of infrastructure for that. It's not something you can provide uh, at most uh, community hospitals. You really need the whole gamut of technologies, and we have that here at CMC, and I think that that's a an important message because that's how you get the best outcomes. I received world-class health care and I also received a lot of care and caring from the people that uh, were working with me, the staff and at UH, and that was key as well to making the whole experience manageable for me. And I say at the end of the day, the whole experience, this whole event has made me a better person. And you know, the folks from UH are a big part in that.